So this is our menu for today. Calderetang baka or in English beef stew. Enjoy your lunch. Hello everyone. I'm going to do a live cooking. And for today, we're going to make a beef stew or in Filipino, it's uh, beef caldereta. So our ingredients are beef, the one with the fat, it's nicer. We got the garlic, onion, and this is the fresh tomato that I pick up from my garden. And then the jalapenos or chili and then potato and carrots and then soy sauce the first thing to do is let's marinate the beef with the soy sauce half a cup let it sit even if it's not too long that's okay you sit it for a while and then we're going to move on the next step Turning the stove. Okay, so let's try to heat the pan on. And then let's start putting on with the garlic. Then we can put the beef that marinated with soy sauce. Just leave it there for at least 30 minutes until the beef becomes tender. So we're just gonna leave it for a while and come back for later. Okay, after 30 minutes, let's see. Mm -hmm. But it still look not tender yet, so we need to wait for another 30 more minutes. Now the beef looks so <clears throat> cooked, tender and soft, we can add now the potatoes and carrots. Let's see how soft it is. Mm. Looks tender now. So the additional ingredients are we need to add a little bit of tomato sauce, just a little, because it will taste so sour when you put too much tomato sauce. And we get some uh, liver spread to add more taste, and the sauce will become a little bit sticky. see the difference when I put the liver spread the consistency of the sabaw and then now this one the tomato sauce I, I mean the potatoes and carrots
and then we will let it simmer for about three more minutes just for the potato to cook and for the carrots also let's see how it goes mm. then we can add the laurel leaves And then the jalapenos and this is uh, optional you can add cheese to give more creaminess or stickiness the sauce. 